An update tonight on the effort to save a local business. Tonight, there's a petition to keep the purple cow. And Fox 17's Michaela Lewis explains how support is growing for the small market. Michaela. Well, Erica, right now, thousands of signatures are on that petition to keep the granny white market, also known as the purple cow. The landlord told Fox 17 on Friday the eviction notice, it's just business. But after 19 years, residents aren't ready for the market to move out. These are my people. These people are rallying around one man's family and business of nearly two decades. It's such a blow we don't, uh, we're just keeping business as usual. Usually, people come to Dan Smith's Purple Cow for sweets, but things turn sour with property owner Reese Smith's notice. I've got five weeks to get out. Now there's more than 5,000 signatures on a petition to keep the Granny White Market. We want them to stay. He gives back to everybody in the community. Everybody knows him. Best place ever. Like he said, this is the best place ever. I mean, the kids love it. Sometimes we don't have enough change. They'll just be like, just pay me next time. This 14-year-old is paying Dan back now, setting up a GoFundMe page. I wanted to help more. Dan knows all of us by name. And we know Dan and the Icy Lady. We actually care about this place, and it's really a home for Dan and his family and just everyone in this community. The community is just getting fueled up in the fight for Dan and the Purple Cow. Many are reaching out to the landlord, making sure he receives exactly what they have to say. Nobody's arguing the owner's rights. It's more of an ethical issue. Reconsider and work with us as a community and try to keep Dan in business here. Songwriter Rivers Rutherford is one of many Forest Hill residents keeping the Smith family in good company on Sunday. Everything seems to be changing in Nashville, but there are some things that don't need to change. Nashville has a lot of dailies. We've only got one Dan. Dan is our people. This is a great turnout. All the love. They're all family spirit, all the support. Tremendous. You can't, you can't buy this. Property owner Reese Smith couldn't be reached for comment today. Purple Cow supporters say they're sending out these letters to him. For more information on all the efforts to save the market, you can visit our website at fox17.com. Michaela Lewis, Fox 17 News.